What's up, everyone? Happy Saturday. So we got something a little different for you today. We are over here at the Elite Painting Office here in Malvern. And it's pouring rain, and Benny didn't show up this morning, so I had to go looking for him. And we found him here. <laughs> we found him over here. What's up? There he is. What's up, everybody? So he's watching me live over there. So, <clears throat> all right, so today's message. So I read a little uh, Joel Osteen uh, message this morning, and it was about being a slave to our past, being a slave to mediocrity, being a slave to addiction and everything else in your life. What are you a slave to? What is holding you back? Uh, we develop a slave mentality where we just um, just exist and don't, try to excel because we think that we're stuck in this place and we can't get out of this place. Um, things have happened in the past, like I said, addiction to, uh, you know, lack to mediocrity. So the message today is what are you a slave to and what do you need to overcome? Um, a lot of people struggle with confidence. You know, going live here is, uh, is a confidence thing. Um, putting yourself out here to the world, saying what you're going to say, uh, opening yourself up to the opinion of others. Uh, you know, a lot of people are slave to their, their I don't know, their, their self-doubt. Uh, a lot of people, you know, don't know what message to put out there, don't know what to say. Um, I had a conversation with a friend the other day, and uh, he's struggling um, with his message. And, you know, a lot of it comes back to core values and what do you stand for. Um, and once you stand for something... You can build off of that. Uh, if you don't know what you stand for, it's hard to put it out there. But um, a lot of us are a slave to different things in our lives, different things that have gone on. And uh, we need to stop and think about what, what are we a slave to? What is holding us back? What are our limiting beliefs? Um, <clears throat> you know, are you not able to sell because you're not sure of yourself? If you don't believe in your product, you don't believe in yourself, who's going to believe in you? Um, so, I mean, the first part of sales is, is just, just being confident that, you know, you got the right product and you're helping people with that product. If you're not sure if your product works and you're not sure if your product has value, how do you sell it? Uh, the same as yourself. If you're not sure that you have value and you're not sure of what you stand for, um, how do you promote yourself in the world? How do you, how do you be a force in the world? How do you be a leader in the world? Uh, how do you make a difference in the world if you don't know what you stand for? So uh, think about today, what are you a slave to in your life? What is holding you back? What are uh, your beliefs that hold you back? Um, and how are you gonna overcome them? How are you gonna overcome the limiting beliefs that are holding you back from what you wanna be and where you wanna go? And do you even know where you wanna be and where you wanna go? Because it starts with that. So, there's our message. Um, short and sweet. We're gonna tighten these things up a little bit. I get yelled at that these things take too long. So, uh, I still got a ride. Uh, we got over here and uh, as I passed by here to find Benny, it started pouring, and we actually wound up having a little uh, powwow in his office over here. Again, this is the uh, headquarters of Elite Painting. We're over here in the heart of Malvern, Malvern train station over here. For those locals, we got the bike out. I brought a towel out. I was gonna when I go down to Long Beach. I was hoping it would stop raining and we can hang out a little bit. But um, so, all right, let's jump on prayers. We got to get this done. We get to put Benny on the spot. He's trying to work over here. Enough of this work crap. It's time to pray. In the name of the Father, the Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Our Father, Father, who art in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy, thy kingdom come, come thy, thy will be done, done on earth as it is in heaven. Give, give us this day our daily bread, and forgive, forgive us our trespasses, as, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy, Holy Mary, Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Uh, dear God, please uh, help all of us get out of our slave mentality. Help us get out beyond our limiting beliefs. Uh, a lot of us suffer with self-doubt, and it keeps us from doing what we want to do in life. Don't doubt yourself. You know, God put... Uh, in your gut, what you need to do, follow your gut, don't doubt yourself. Um, so many people I talk to, um, the more people I talk to, the more people that I coach, um, 
Everyone's got limiting beliefs. Don't limit yourself. Just get out there and do it. We ride at dawn every day. Don't let anything hold you back. You know, uh, this, this We Ride at Dawn thing, we're 89 days in. We're almost a quarter of the way there on the mission. 89 of 365, I think like 91 or so is a uh, quarter of the way. So uh, I'm about a quarter of the way there. Every morning I get up, it's raining, um, and we're still riding. We're out here. Of course, we made a little pit stop to go find Benny this morning. We didn't show up. <laughs> I had to come looking for him. But um, don't don't satisfy. Don't, don't settle for limiting beliefs, guys. Just get out there and do it. So many of you have so much potential. And I see it in you. And every time I talk to all of you, you just, you're holding yourselves back. Don't doubt it. Don't doubt it. Just get your confidence up. Say a prayer. Have faith and just go out and do it. Get things done. Ride at dawn every day, no matter what happens in your life. You have a message to share. Uh, God put stuff in you that you need to share. And you need to get out there and do it. So, that being said, happy Saturday. Uh, try and stay dry. We're over here with Mr. Elite today. And uh, he's up here doing the work nice and early. I don't know, he's trying to make excuses for the ride <laughs> that he's doing work and he's not no going to ride. No excuses. But, um, so, all right, so that's our message today. Get out there and uh, believe in yourself. Don't let stuff hold you back. Don't be a slave to your past, to your addictions, to your failures, to whatever's happened in your life. That isn't a past move forward. You have a message to share. Get out there and do it. All right, everyone, happy Saturday. Come ride with me tomorrow morning. Everyone, peace out. Take care. Bye-bye.